So this is a sparkle poop. La Fontaine sparkle poop. The Metcalf version. <laughs> no, the second time I lost them. Okay, so these we're going to tie in off the sides. And this is kind of a sparkle pupa. Do you put the shock in first? I'm going to show you a little trick. Okay. So this fly as well, you can fish it, throw it out in the film, put a shot on and nymph it, either either. Take that, and then we're just gonna brush her out. Brush her out. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe for beginners, yeah. Yes, for beginners. <laughs> So you're holding the flush down with your dumping. It's being lazy. So we're going to work that up again. We're going to taper it up. Right up to there. What other uh, magical uh, tinsel type things do you use for breeding? Anything I grab. Whatever you have in the drawer. Anything I grab. It's metal. It's just... So this is going to go back. We're going to run these right off the side. I see what you're going to do. You're going to take a couple of clips off the uh, That's right. thing to, to get here. <clears throat> when you cut it, it's too late. You got to retie. So we're going to take this, go down the side, and we're going to just bubble that up. We're just going to form a little bubble there. Then, now, we're going to take a couple of pieces. And we're going to pull that back. That will be the shot. Makes sense. So you, you pull the loop back and then you just snipped a couple of them yep. and straight down. Really what you should do is one side, tie more material in. If that's the side you're going to, like that would be good form to do that. Yeah. Can you pull it over this and then rather than cutting the loop? Uh, yeah, or you could just even just tie in the shuck before you even start to fly. <coughs> I've never seen a uh, uh, Fontaine's tied with the orange color. Is he on? Um, but, it looks it looks really buggy in the water. This yeah. Maybe not the color. It's more uh, profile. Right? Um, <clears throat> you know, you could go tan, yeah. green. I've only got one color of Zelons. So. 
It's the orange. So this one we're not going to flare up as much. We're going to lay it in right off the back. Flare it a bit, but that's coming off. So we're going to go in there, we're going to work our way back. And then we're going to get rid of this all together. We're not going to we're not going to give it the um, I'll care to trim. We're going to take it right off. Back. I'm going to clean this up. So we want to protect that head. back this right up and then we're going to color it up. But first we're going to lay this down flat here just so it's easier. So you want enough just just so it kind of looks caddisy like you want it not enough that it's going to fish like that but just enough. We're going to take some of this. Now here's the thing. This could get crowded in there big time. So what we're going to do, right there, that's where it's dropping in. That's going to be problems there. And when you tie it off, these hairs are going to get in the way. I'm always crowding the eye. So, we're going to go back here and tie right here. We don't even have to play with the front of the fly. With that color, and with this thread, you'll never know the difference. And you don't, this way you don't even have to play that game. You just throw in a couple half hitches or whatever. Who is it? One of the uh, Leo guys sticks the head in uh, lip seal. 